All right, I wanna to talk to you today about the benefits of owning property versus just controlling it. I know a lot of mentors and educators will talk about controlling it, and I'm all for that, but I want you to understand the pros and cons. There are a lot of benefits to the sub two purchase and the owner financing purchase tax-wise, instead of just simply cashing out at the end of a sandwich lease. It's a different type of income, and I'll tell you what sparked this. High six associate Mike, leaves me a voice text. I have some people that are, uh, that are accountable to me every night and so I can help them progress, like literally every day. And he left a message saying, hey, great news, I had a cash out. Uh, not so great news, I got a big tax bill. And I said right back, because I coached in many moments like that, and I said, okay, Mike, but here's the deal. Let's get you zeroed, laser focused, zeroed in on owning property this year instead of just a sandwich lease. And most people, most associates get that after a few deals. So I want you to know up front because I didn't know it when I started back in the creative real estate space and the term space back in 12 and 13, even though I'd been in the business for a long time before that, I just know, I knew back then that I needed cash like I needed water or oxygen. And all I wanted to do is go do deals. So I ended up doing a whole bunch of sandwich leases, come to find out I got whacked on taxes. So with sub two and owner financing, you legally own the property. And because you own the property, the taxation is different. Plus you have the ability to pivot when you own it versus having a clock ticking with a sandwich lease end date. So let's talk about the differences. Paydays one and three in the three payday trademark system we have for a sandwich lease or an AO and a sign out, you're gonna report that payday one and three as active operating income. You're gonna be taxed at your tax bracket and you're gonna be subject to self-employment tax right now roughly 15.3%. That's a big deal. Now, again, don't quote me on the, the amount. This is as of today and from my CPA. I'm just giving you the differences here. Now, payday one, a post where I just said, when you own the property, yeah, you're gonna report it differently as passive income. You're gonna be taxed at your tax bracket, but there's no self-employment tax when you own it. Payday three when you own it, again, unlike one and three lumped in together with a sandwich lease, you're taxed at the capital gains rate because you own the property and you sell out, payday three is when you sell off. You're gonna be usually right now 15 to 20%-ish and no self-employment tax. So when you own the home, I said earlier, in addition to those uh, tax differences, you're gonna have more pivots. For example, we call in our community something we call wealth stacking and that's when we take a portfolio and we can take say a sandwich lease and change it to a sub two. Once we get ownership of it, we change it to a sub two or once we, take ownership initially as a sub two owner financing, think of the differences here. I have a sub two deal, that means I have no end date. That means what? That means I could, I own it indefinitely, so I could own a finance, a buyer eventually. There's technique around that for a different video. Uh, my son Nick handles all our buyers. We can talk about things like that uh, at a later date with you. And you can also catch details of that in our QLS home study course. Now, other pivots, just to give you an idea. You have an owner financing deal. We've done this on a lot of deals. and. Uh, an end date, let's say, of 48 months. Literally, we did this on one of our deals. We call around the two-year mark, and we say, hey, uh, I know you have two years left, and you have X amount due at the end of that. How about if we send you, in this case, we sent someone on a 183 grand note. We sent him six grand around Christmas time. And we asked for that six grand, I think it was 6,200. We asked for a year extension. So, and they said yes, because why? Because they were getting monthly principal payments, and instead of just collecting those, it was $923 a month, I remember it. Instead of just collecting those for the next two years and then a balloon, we want to prepay six grand of principal. And for that, we asked for another year extension. So now our four-year deal went to five years. The next Christmas, they asked, hey, would you do that thing again? We did it, and it went to a six-year deal. The next year, they said, will you do that thing again? And we said, well, here's another idea. Why don't we extend this 15 years, and instead of doing principal only, We'll go ahead and pay you interest. We'll amortize the balance and pay you interest. Their accountant loved it. They're in retirement mode and this is what worked for them. So the point is, I could go on and on with our deals. The point is when you have a sub two, you have complete ability to pivot, to wealth stack, to finance a buyer. And when you have an owner financing deal, you have a chance to renegotiate and do some creative things as well. In addition to all the tax benefits. So you can sort of behave uh, like a realtor or a mortgage broker. And I say that because that's sort of like you do when you do AOs or sandwich leases. You're getting that one check and it's active uh, income. Or you can creatively control property or better control it and then wealth stack and just continue to parlay the tax advantages by owning. And by the way, I'm not picking on realtors or mortgage brokers. I was a realtor for 18 years before getting into the creative space in 13. But if you're a mortgage broker or a realtor, let me just plant this seed. Why not 
either A, learn it, learn what we do in the creative space so that you can better serve your clients, be the authority to your clients, be the specialist to your clients. I guarantee you your competition's not doing it. Or B, refer to us or one of our associates around the country. And if you wanna see what we do as far as that and how we treat realtors and how we actually pay you to do that, go to OriginalRE.com, OriginalRE.com. That's our personal family website, nothing to do with the coaching business. Now, I know some of this is super detailed. I'd love you to come meet our tax, special, uh, tax specialists. I'd love you to come meet some of our students. The next event as of the filming of this video is gonna be in September. We do them twice a year. It's gonna be in September in Newport, Rhode Island. And it, you can just go to the website QLS for Quantum Leap System, QLSLive.com. Now, if you're seeing this at a later date, we also do the second event a year live around the end of March, and that's wickedsmartsummit.com. Both in Newport, Rhode Island, both live, both events that will literally change the way you think about real estate and hopefully begin the process of transforming your life in general. Now, in the meantime, before the event, I'd love you to, if you have not already, grab our books. You don't have to go to Amazon and pay for them. They're best sellers there. Just go to wickedsmartbooks.com forward slash YouTube, wickedsmartbooks.com forward slash YouTube. Now, lastly, if you wanna just take a look for free at a whole bunch of deals being done, and so you can understand a little bit more, especially if you're new to the channel, about how these deals work and how the three payday system works that we've trademarked, just head over to YouTube at Smart Real Estate Coach channel. We actually have different playlists. Every single Monday, we put out a Motivational Monday. Check them out, subscribe to the channel. Every single Sunday, we put out Deal Structure Sundays. There's gotta be 200 plus in there now. I didn't look recently, but there's at least 200 plus live deals or deal-related stuff that you can look at. And then we have Q&A Thursdays. Common questions that come in from people just like you or weekly on our Wicked Smart Sit Down that is free to attend for you every week, every Thursday. And then we put those back out on YouTube so you can learn from them. So enjoy, hope to see you at QLS Live. Go to qlslive.com. <music>